already a disaster here on the 10th oh wait is it it's the, the 11th, 11th day of christmas dave a disaster on the 11th day of christmas i'm already concerned do, do, do. Welcome back to Beverage Buddies here on the Snack Network. My name is Dave Moore. Joining me, of course, is Curtis Lane. Hi, Curtis. Hi, Dave. How's it going? Oh, oh, spectacular, Curtis. Absolutely spectacular. We're recording this during the day, so my lighting's a little bit weird. Um, I mean, it's still dark out is the thing. You, you think that. You think that the lighting in here would be exactly the same as every other prior episode to this show. It's you not. just you do look brighter. I'll give it that. I mean, yeah, Mine's I, in a, I'm in a closed surrounding, so can, mine is going to be the same no matter what. That, that's yeah, a, that looks more like the other ones, but I like the what you had going on. Okay. Turn that back on. All right, all right. Let's, let's just give it a little bit more mood. We're almost to Christmas Eve here. Yeah, it's brighter. It's happier times. Yeah, yeah, right. Just constantly adjust mid show. It's it's oh, really refreshing. Oh, jeez, that's so bright now. <laughs> <laughs> that's what we were at. <laughs> I like it. Go with it. Okay. Um. Hi, hi, Curtis. Uh, we ha- we have our eleventh beer from the. We tw- do. Told us a Christmas. I shook that can a little bit too much when I lifted it's it up. Okay. It's from the Rochester Mills Beer Company. Thank you guys and... again for the twelve days of Christmas milkshake stouts. Special. Oh yeah, absolutely. And this is the Imperial Tripper Triple Layer Decadence Milkshake Stout. Try Tripper. saying that. Try saying that ten times fast. I can't, and I won't. <laughs> um, How's that? You know, you started reading the ingredients. One, I hate coconuts. There's coconuts in here. I hate coconut yeah, that's, water. That's I hate coconut thing. flavored anything. Um, one of those. I'm co- not a big fan. One of those coconut um candy bars, those chocolate candy bars that you get at Halloween. Mounds or uh, no. almond joy. Yeah, almond joys. <laughs> Gross. This, if it's gonna be like anything, I feel like it's gonna be closer to something with toasted coconut, which I don't know of a lot of things with toasted coconut on top. Yeah, but the fact that these last couple have been this Imperial, like we had Imperial, we had Imperial Java, and now we have Imperial Triple Chocolate to go against blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Triple yeah. layer decadence. So I, I'm kind of curious because I know this is going off of some sort of cake. I, I'm i not sure on what kind, but I'm guessing like maybe like a German chocolate cake kind of feel with toasted coconut all over it or something yeah, like that. Yeah, probably something like that. Um, also, the cans have gotten quite lazy. This one has like I, I don't know if you can see, but it's not straight. Well, it's, no, on, let me, we're we're help. never gonna be able. There to There you help. go. I have a second light, so it has it's, like some sort of pattern in it, but I think it's uh, just like shredded coconut darkened a little bit. Yeah, like it's but that's kinda, all I got. It's kind of boring, and it looks yeah. very much like the 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 coffee beans from yesterday. Like you can see the beans. Like you can kind like if you get close, you can kind of make something out. But it's like if I hold it right here to the camera, it's black. Oh yeah, That's like it. like yeah, you're looking at this on our on our YouTube channel, like it's you know, dark. It's, you're, black. it's very quite boring. I'm just trying to like wipe off the condensation so like maybe you could see, but like it, there's no way to wipe, see it there. Wipe off the condensation so we can uh, scan the barcode. Remember those days? Oh dude, I remember. <laughs> scan it. Beep beep. I used to spend a lot of time at the grocery store doing that. Yeah. Um I forget, Sorry, this is a side note. What game was that where you used to like you had to get a scanner? It, was it Digimon? Oh, the, for, it might have been in real life. Yeah, this was a real life thing. Like when I so like I I think I know what you're talking about. You're talking about like the like Timag- Tamagotchi pet kind of style game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where you'd go around and scan barcodes, and it was mm-hmm. like this hot thing in like the late '90s, maybe early 2000s. Probably yeah, the late was, '90s, early 2000s, absolutely. Probably Digimon. Yeah. All right. All right. I had one of those. I started I, when I learned I could scan like every video game I had because mm-hmm. they all had barcodes. I was like, "Oh, my whole world has changed." And it was really yeah, dumb. It, was it it was it was one of those things that when it came and went. Yeah, not as cool. But as yeah, Pokemon. so you ready to open this yes, can? Yes, of we, triple layer decadence. It's gonna just be all chocolatey and coconutty and bleh. All right, ready. I have this weird feeling it's gonna taste like a Hostess Snowball. Oh, I, I got a, I, I got a whiff of something before I even cracked it open all the way. Oh, so I get the, I get the slight thing of coconut, but I don't know how I'm gonna feel about this. I, I mean, you honest. liked the one yesterday. Yeah, but I'm not a, I'm not a huge fan of coconut. I like coffee, but that's different. Coffee and coconut are not the same thing. This does smell a lot like yesterday's with coconut replacing yeah, the like, coffee. Yeah, it's got like a hint of coconut. This smells like. 
two days ago. So like day eight when we were at the Imperial Stout with coconut. Oh, I'm not. I'm not super excited, but I'm not like scared or anything. It's not like it's going to blow me away. I feel like this is just going to be like day eight with coconut. <laughs> or day day nine. I'm sorry, because I forgot we're on 11. Man, yeah. I'm bad at this. Yeah, well, you know. Um, Numbers are hard. <laughs> it's. I'm just getting day nine with coconut. Just like a, the hint, the most LaCroix-esque hint of coconut. Ew, LaCroix coconut. That, that's probably the worst one. It's I don't. It, it's like that. That's what it's that I'm kind of getting. I like throwing and, shade at LaCroix because I've never had one. Really? Ever? Never had a single. I drink LaCroix. them like all the time. Oh yeah, you're cool. Well, I I also get like the off-brand ones from like Aldi where it's like oh lime passion fruit. I just don't like all the high fructose corn syrup. That's all. But I drink beer, so just replace it's, it with something else. Basically, yeah. It's like I drink Lacroix to get water, and also so I can have an extra slice of cake. <laughs> it's how I can rationalize it in my brain. Except you could just drink water. But I like bubbles. That's my thing. I like bubbles. I like flavor too. I just like a hint of flavor. Yeah, that's why I like the off-brand ones because they're less Lacroix, like hint of something, like hint of hint of lime. Yeah. It's more, this is lime flavored soda water. Enjoy. <laughs> so it's a spray. So, okay. Okay. So we should, we should probably <laughs> pretty drink much this. It, it smells kind of like a Mounds bar. Oh, it does taste like an Almond Joy. Ha. Huh. Oh. <laughs> oh, it tastes uh, like an Almond Joy. It tastes exactly it, like an almond joy. Okay, so this I, is, I'm personally not a fan of this. Yeah. Uh huh. But the exhale is probably worse. Uh, okay. Did, I'm, I'm did gonna, you exhale it all and I, like get I, that mounds like overall over flavor? <sighs> ah. Oh. Oh. Almond Why joys. Why say eleven? <laughs> Why? Why do we oh, end on a poor note? Um, T- tomorrow better be amazing. <laughs> like day day twelve, that that red velvet better be like on point. Because <sighs> I'm not I'm not feeling this at all. Like I I like coconut per per se. Like I know I just said I'm like I'm not the biggest fan, but I I like coconut as like a general sense. But I'm not a big fan of toasted coconut in my beer. On on a, on a note though, like if you like almond joys. Oh, this is delicious. For this you, this tastes more like an almond joy than it tastes like a beer. Yeah, I and, would even uh, I would I would say it tastes more like a Mounds because it's more like that dark chocolatey bite instead of the the milk chocolate. Yeah, um, I am not a fan of this. I would say that people will enjoy this. Oh, I am yeah. not one of them. It is also the only beer of all of these that really to me does not taste like a beer at all. I would agree with that. Like like not yeah. even a little bit. Like there there is coconut, there is chocolate bar, and that's kind of it. Yeah. It's a little it's a little funky to me. Like I, I could see people enjoying this. This is not a bad beer by any sense, but it's just I I can't get over I can't do this flavor personally. Somebody told me go drink this clock out. It'll taste just like you're drinking liquid peanut butter. It tasted like a really dark beer. It tasted yeah. like a dark peanut butter stout. It did not taste like peanut butter. Yeah, if someone this... handed this to me and was like, hey, this is going to taste like Almond Joy. Go drink it. And I drank it. It'd be like, yeah, you're not wrong. You're giving me Almond Joys in a you, liquid form. You, you, you can't – you followed through with your promise. It was – it's it's coconutty. Like I, I, I got to give them props. It tastes like what they, they say it tastes like. It's chocolate and it's coconut. That's what it is. Do yeah, I well, like it? Well, well, no. Uh, they call it triple layer de- de- delegates. <laughs> are you having a problem saying decadence? decadence? Are you okay? Thank you, Curtis. Decadence. Do I need to call an ambulance? Probably. <laughs> <laughs> an, a decadent ambulance. <laughs> Some decadence with your ambulance. Should we pour this? I, I guess we kind of have to. I, I mean... We are contractively obligated. Ooh, I Sorry, spl- I'm running into court. Splash my, splash my thumb a little bit. It pours pretty good. You didn't. You didn't get a really big head on yours. 
There you go. There it is. Yeah, I did. Oh, okay. When I saw it pouring, it did pretty well. Did pretty well. I glugged it a little bit to get that head on it. Finishing this is going to be interesting. Smelling it out. Of, smelling it out of the cup. Oh my god! It just smells like a. It smells like mound slash almond joy. I personally think it. And oh, I actually, I'm going to agree with you. It does smell more like an almond joy. Yeah. It's got that nut. Yeah, it's the nut taste. It's the gross almond joy nut taste. Hey, hey, uh, trick or treaters next year, 2021 trick or treating when it seems like it'll probably be normal. Hopefully, um. If it's still not normal, I want to tell you what I'm going to do really quick for trick-or-treating. Take all my Almond get... Joys. I'm just going to leave Almond Joys. I'm just going to get big no. bags of Almond Joys and no, just leave them out. No, nobody will want them. It'll be fine. No, it's not what you do. You get the full-size candy bars, and you got to get a T-shirt cannon. Yeah. That's where I'm at next year. I'm gonna, I'm shooting T-shirts and candy bars. Somebody built a um, PVC pipe. Yeah, I saw that. Yeah, there were a couple of those. There's... Like the little ramp? Yeah, where it... It, basically, it's a tube. Oh, you're, you're sipping us out of the glass. I, I don't like it even more. It has got worse. It's more like intense and perfumey now. <sighs> oh, it is. You're right. It's perfumey. Perfumey it is like it's like more coconut. <laughs> 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 I, I, I was like, I, maybe maybe in the glass it'll like tone down. Maybe the chocolate notes will come out. No, it's like you want to punch a coconut to the face. <laughs> God, you know, I, I, I'm not trying to rip on you guys. I really did like oh. a couple of these. There's a lot of these in this 12 pack that I liked. Um, I'm not ripping on them at all. Like they, it, it is what they said it is. It's got coconut. It's chocolate. That you're you're getting it. Hundred percent, you're getting it. <laughs> it's just not. I I just don't want it. It's not what I want. I just want more beer with my beer. I don't want toasted coconut with my chocolate and a beer. <laughs> Well, Ooh, to all those out burp, there though. who like almond joys, I'm so sorry. Um, there's something <laughs> Not... mentally wrong with you. And... Oh, I'm I'm sorry. There's, there's nothing mentally wrong with them. They just got bad taste buds. That's all. Oh yeah, you know that's not a mental problem. No, 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 no. You just got bad taste buds. No, oh, that's well, all. That's fine. That's cool. People are different. You know, it doesn't mean a mental problem. <laughs> They just got bad taste buds. You, you're just different. You're just wrong. It's like it's, it's like those people. There you go. You're wrong. It's just simple. You're wrong. <laughs> it's it's like the people who like licorice, like black licorice. It's oh like, yeah, no. You're I, just wrong. <laughs> I like I like red licorice. So uh, here's my weird thing. I don't like black licorice. I like red licorice. I really love Jägermeister, which is black licorice. Strange. It's weird. I don't like black licorice other than than Jägermeister. Hmm. Hmm. But I barely buy Jägermeister because it's a, it's, it's that drink that you drink to stay drunk for a while and forget your life. Anyway, to our friends, we'll see you tomorrow for Christmas Eve on the Twelve Days of Christmas Milkshake Shout Special with Beverage Buddies. I'm Dave Moore. That's Curtis Lane. You can follow us with any of the links in the description. If you enjoyed watching. Curtis suffer drinking coconut juice. Uh, please subscribe to the channel and hit the like button. Leave a comment down below of anything you guys want us to try in the new year, and we'll see you guys tomorrow for the twelfth day of Christmas. I got it to empty the glass. <laughs> you did it. <coughs> it was rough. Uh.